Hello, it's Matthew again, or with Amnesia, whichever the like in there be of. Was it, um, anyway, I'm here to do another update video. It's been about a week or a little short there from, or whatever. But, uh, anyway. What was it, uh, this is just, uh, another just rough update, more or less, what I've been doing or thinking of. I've been trying to make this a somewhat weekly, uh, ordeal or event or whatever have you. And, um,. You know, it's just that I want to make this whole thing, you know, um, uh, actually have some type of schedule, because it's, I've had problems more or less in the past, where just, uh, things just get awry, and they go adrift on me there, and say, oh, where will the time go, you know, <laughs> those type of things. So, basically, I've, uh, as I've seen before, and I've, well, just, just briefly there, I, uh, I've done some work on the major for or oh, underbelly. I've made half the uh, the rooms. They're not polished or done. There's no NPC, no dial, or these type of things. You know, it's about a quarter, maybe not even a quarter of a quarter, twelve point five percent. I don't know about that. You know, so this is not even done. See, it's the like little placeholder miniature things aren't even done, right? I don't think these buildings are even like uh, you can't even walk in them. I think yeah. So yeah. No, not the upper part's not done yet, right? So let's just go around to the. So it feels weird. Should we go around like the. I'll just do the left. Left hand side. Left hand side just is where it normally goes. Just because I started from there. I started from the left and all the way to the right buildings. It's just, you know, it's a bit of a boring update. You know, nothing really super crazy. Let's be going through all the rooms and whatnot. And, you know, they're all pretty much look the same because it's you have to copy and paste and these type of things. You know, only one person had to, you know, get the production somewhat you know, uh, respectable, or what have you there, so, this, these buildings on the top part, even some on the bottom of the core there, uh, you know, they're barmaid, so, hopefully, you know, this is a bug tested, hopefully, so it looks, you know, it's a bit clunky in some things, because it's, you know, it's not like, you know, from the doors you have to walk into, you can't really walk into them, it's a little, they look kind of weird, but it's all trying to get, you know, functional, right, it's a bit functional, and this is what most of the houses look like, just like this, and, you know, the outside wall and black and not. So you know, thinking like, you know, put like NPCs here, you know, maybe have like, maybe thinking like, you know, mages just to be like there, you know, maybe the students would be down here or something, study people, shops or something, whatever, right? Some type of culture or some type of living atmosphere. Not boring or it's all like, uh, what's that 60s TV show? I can't remember the name of it, but it was, everything was like, uh, Stepford Wise, that one? Yeah, they're all like the weird and the same ones, like that, really. But, um, was it even 60s? I can't remember. But, um... Yeah, so this, this is all more or less boring here, but it, it's just, you know, what I've been up to. So yeah, every house here works. I'm going to skip over it, but, you know, it's, these are kind of an update video. More just talk about whatever, more or less. Where do I, uh, do I even do much today? Outside, it's making the game. It's really just like, you're doing crap outside of clearing the uh, RV trail. But this is more about uh, games and stuff, really. So the whole plan of this place, right, get back on topic here. Is like uh, to have just just like an actual city because there's so many games and they go out and they just uh, they just they, they do like the minimum you know like, oh this is good enough this is like, the feeling of it that's good you know so I was really thinking about character you know like what makes things feel like character what what impacts upon a person you know so I was like you know I've always liked the depth you know, the boulders get going the houses you steal your stuff I wish you could do that to the depth but you know, one person I don't do so much. They're like, you know, be sneaky and clever and, you know, and just find, find things that's going to be cheap, you know, first iteration of these type of things, yeah. So I just, these, these supposed to be people in them, I really think will make, just cordon them off, little rooms, whatnot, down there, I don't know. But, uh, you know, go from room to room here, clearing out the little skeletons up. They're just like flavor, you know. It's like, for example, World of Warcraft is very huge on the character, they're not, they like, kind of throw reality out the door a little bit, the realism. But it's easier to work on like stuff like that, you know. It's easier to be like, oh yeah, he's got a giant sword because you can, you know, your subconscious and all that type of stuff, you know, it works on that. And, you know, it's really, you see it like boom, in one second, it's memorable. Right? This stuff is too real. It's sometimes it gets like uh, uh, gray and brown, gray and brown and green and brown and gray. It's like, oh, this is boring. You know? Where's that? Like EverQuest. Look, I zoom around in EverQuest there, and well, not you know, game, they're probably nice eyes, but the you know, the zone view, I didn't want to grind every really big. EverQuest is pretty grindy, holy geez. I spend my time working this type of stuff, and 
you know, so I just zoom around cheating, I guess, on the zone view there. And a lot of inspiration I see. Like, you know, I guess there's nothing new quite under sun. The more things change, the more it stay the same. And I remember, you know, it seems like a little work. I took a lot of inspiration for EverQuest, I guess. You know, most people don't like play EverQuest. I guess it's just a like, subscription that was looking into it. But, you know, I've always been interested by EverQuest. You know, it's always been like the, um, that kind of prototype, kind of weird game that, you know, it's, 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 it's like the bastard uncle's nephew, you know, kind of once or twice, you know, it's interesting, and like, what the, what's going on here, right, kind of odd, doesn't fit in, it's kind of, but it has, you know, characters got everything going, you know, it's like the older uh, child in the block, I don't know, it's a weird analogy, anyway. but, um, yeah, I was just been monkeying around with just EverQuest, just uh, looking around the zones, and I was at the Lake of Ill Omen, and I was like, oh, zoom around, pop, you know, just, you know, flying around and whatnot, and, and I was like, hmm, I was thinking about, you know, World of Warcraft, how this impacted that, and the character, you know, the character, let me go back to my point, but, you know, circular here, but, um, you know, it, it seems to impact, even EverQuest, it's kind of bland in some areas, kind of weird and contrived, and, you know, but it had character in certain areas that, they were pungent enough to stick with the dev the development team or the World of Warcraft days. You know, I want to make a game like World of Warcraft. You know, I don't want to make some crappy ass RPG thing that you know, it's just like maybe I will make it a crappy one. You know, maybe hopefully that's not all I make, but you know, I'll try at least to do something about it. And anyway, the point is that like even these type of shitty games like this one here, you know, it's like you can uh, I'm not shitty, but I try to make it at least somewhat decent and playable. Um, this is not a good example of that, but this is rough dudes, right? You know, rough dude. And, like, you have to have some character. You can't just have, like, bland ass, here's a house, and here's a this, and here's that. Yeah, it will work. I always combine, like, do two things. And I said this before, but, in a video, but, like, uh, you combine, like, at least, you know, usually two things together, you know, and made, made it interesting. You know, it was like, uh, it wasn't just, just a mage. Like, here's just the mage place. Like, mages were doing something else, and there was always something funky involved. It was like trolls. And Jamaican, you know, it was like these type of things. You know, it's like you had like examples where to put spun on things. Like, oh, I remember, I remember that. Like Warhammer, you know, I guess War World of Warcraft's kind of like Warhammer. I think this was was kind of aiming towards it being like a Warhammer tie-in kind of kind of deal type of thing. And um, in the beginning, and it was just kind of did its own thing for legal reasons, or whatever it was, you know, whatever it was. But it kept that kind of pungent, like um, just tank. Who's the guy? I think it's me. Artist dude, the rock star kind of band who's joined the blue. Like, had a very a lot of character to it, right? And just like it was very pungent, and um, I know, it was about 50 rooms, by the way. I'm just saying that, blah, 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 a little bit over 50, 52, I think. I've, I've done it's more like this, but kind of bland, but oh, is it, it's the base anyway. So, Warcraft had this really pungent character about it, you know, that, that stuck with me. I guess they you know, took things that were like it, you know, like the good ideas and you know, let's stick around, I suppose. And, and uh, if you remember quests, like Ironforge, the big circle of Ironforge World of Warcraft, it's like, uh, it's, it's like, the, what the hell is the name? It starts with a K, I can't remember what it is. Uh, there's that. It's, it's the Dwarf City in EverQuest. It's like a big circle. It's just like a big, uh, big circle. And then it's like certain things are from, you know, the, the cathedral things, like the see elements of like storm wind or not, you know, in there, and the cathedral there. And it took little bits and pieces. Oh, yeah, back to the Lake of Illoma, I forgot some French point there. There's like, you go to Moonglade, right? And there's Omen, like the dog thing, whatever, right? It's like, you know, like Illoma, and stuff like that, Solar Omen. These type of things, they always took the kind of tongue in cheek of Warcraft. They always had that, that value of, 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 of character, sometimes too much. You know, where it's like, yes, got people, this is too cartoony, draws people away, you know, but it's, uh, we kept the graphics longevity. I've always wanted this type to be, like, you know, a little bit like that, like, 25%, you know, not, like, you know, super crazy, but, like, you have some character to it, but not, like, super duper crazy, like, maybe vibrant, like, super vibrant. I always like Boulder's Gate, for example, you know, Boulder's Gate, Boulder's Gate, Boulder's Gate, but it's, it's, um, for me, it's very pungent, it's very pungent, um, uh, experience probably it's very like you go out there and say you can do the story and whatever I said this before but it's I've always liked the realism and, and, and the grounding uh, behind uh, Baldur's Gate that you really, really grounded like it's like oh, an adventure so like I'm plunked into like almost the medieval at times you know enhanced or not enhanced but you know improved you know like there's magic there's dragons there's basilisks there's kobolds and crazy people. it's memorable it's almost like those old 90s cartoons with the voice actors always pungent it's kind of like but, but, uh, not campy, not campy, but, like, not campy, but, like, or contrived, but it is, it is, you know, it's 
punch. I was thinking about today too. A lot was overlooked is sound design. You know, in games, like, always, all these like sound effects, like World of Warcraft, all the little icons will ching ching and whatever, right? And the uh, you know every every little sound, all this type of thing. It's very memorable. You know, it always it builds into the atmosphere of games. It's, it's so pungent because it has no sound. This game right now, it's just it's just like. It's just do loo loo loo. You have to make you know, whatever. You play other music in the background. It doesn't sound good. Do loo but whatever. It's 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 without something you get to appreciate. Sometimes when you don't have something, you you appreciate it, and then it's gone. These type of things, right? And um, all these ideas float around my head. Just just like what should I be putting into this game? What should you know? What what do I, what does what feels right? Not just idle emotions, but you know what what feels. Uh, this game deserves. You know what? What, what will make this more valuable? You know, I want. I don't want some crappy. You know, just throwing up there. Here's a kind of half ditch effort of a RPG. It's too many of those. Just too many. If people are tired of those. You know, people are tired of these music. You know, the game industry of just these just half baked titles and just people not trying them. I just want to really try out this game. You know, to, uh, all the crazy cities, all the rooms, all the people, all the dialogue. I don't love the game. I mean, you handle it, but we'll see. We'll see. You know, this is a learning experience for me. You know? It's like a rookie syndrome where you go in there and it's like, and you try really hard, whatever, right? And like, I don't know all my limits. And just get the big contract and you're like, oh man, I'm lazy. And I don't want to be like that because I know like, the downfall. Some people, you know. Success changes people, you know. I don't know if it's successful, hopefully, you know, but you know, I've seen it change people. And they get the big job and they get the, the contract thing, and it's just like everything. Uh, they stop like they stop being hungry, they get comfortable. And it's like, I don't want this, I want I don't want the money and all these type of things. Maybe it'll hit the crit and load. This would be like a, a funny thing later on, but hopefully not. You know, I'm, I'm not betting against myself here. And um, yeah, I'm just trying to find people. It's just so. Difficult as another point. It's just like, great games aren't made just by alone by great content. Great content comes from great people. Great games are made by great people. It's so difficult to find people. It's just uh, just go so zoom around in chat and like look around for people and just it's just uh, maybe I'm looking in the wrong place. And the idea is not bad. It's just that the, the way I'm going about it is wrong. I suppose I don't know. Uh, I was yeah. I think recently I was in this like. Uh, Found this person, I was on DV, or whatever it is. You know, There's a bunch of gay artists, people, gamer people, right? And I was like, too crazy on, on the Discord. Just going nuts. And, I just, and, I was, and they, I, I eventually got kicked out, I think. I was like, oh, wow, this, this went too crazy on it. I didn't know what that saying means. Just, just made us too much, too much talking. I don't know, it's different. It was just, uh, whatever. But, um, I just, you know, life happens like that, you know? It just keeps on going. It's just, yeah, all these type of things. It's just, so you have to fail and iterate and fail and iterate if you want things. People always want things just too quick. And they, you know, it's, these are like the hell years. Right? These are like the, holy crap, you're all hands on deck and it's just yourself. It's a funny joke, but you gotta, you know, stick with it. Oh, yeah, that's how I feel. Like, yeah, stick with these things. Like, that's some businesswoman was like saying. I mean, she was beating the same points over from I don't know, but she's saying, like, Everything's like a battle of attrition, you're just gonna punch your way through, you know, and like articulate yourself in such a way that you just you don't give up. You just stick with things, you just keep on going. Everyone gives up, you know, like the Les Brown video. The old, the big bugs in there. Not, it's, it's like, uh, you know, be hungry and follow your dreams, whatever it is. You know? Maybe we'll put a link in the description of it, you know, it's a good video, watch it. And it's, you know, it's like, not everyone will see. You, you know, your dreams through, or just be yourself, just, just be yourself, I was thinking today, you know, like, like the saying, I think the undead, whatever, in the Warcraft, like, you know, we press on, you know, like, I'm thinking, like, I'm kind of like that, in a way, you know, it's like, I press onward, I press onward, and these type of things, I just keep on saying this over and over myself, you know, it's like, I press onward, and onward, it's like, because it's like, I get some people, and I talk to them, like, oh, this, this is interesting, blah, 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 it's not convenient, oh, and it's like, oh, come on, get, get going, guys, push forward, push, come on, and it's like, oh, I don't force them, it's just like, try to get the, the cheerleader going, and they're like, oh, depressing, and it's like, oh, come on, guys, come on, going, and it's like, uh, and it's like, it falls apart, it's like, yeah, I'm bold as gate, and it's like, I guess maybe, I think, I think, I think the, the real life friend, you have people like those, you know, have a dearth thereof, 
dearth of people. I just grew up and there was like, like all these people, and no one really gravitated towards as a friend. It was just weird. But I was it. Uh, I was like, oh, Matthew, I'm like, oh, hello. I forget your face and your name, and but I, I think I remember you. And so, oh, and it's weird. It's like opposite. But I haven't found anyone to really make games with. I've always been maybe that's why I'm looking around crazy all the time. Looking around for uh, people to play games with because I just never had anyone. Anyway, the whole point is that, like, um, like it's. It, it, it's pleasant. Uh, it's, it's difficult to make these games just by yourself and having uh, people, you know, come and go and come and go. So it, it takes a toll on you, you know. You're doing all this effort and this type of thing. I'm not going to moan and whatever. And complain. I'm saying it's just, ugh, you know, and this isn't for everybody either. It's a very, very specialized field, I suppose. Not like, oh, what do you mean a specialized field? Oh, oh, no, it's like people just don't want to do this. It's just, you know, people want to play the games. It's fine. You know, playing games too, but it's just, you know, just want to make the damn games and then they can her push on with them. It's just, ugh, it's just. Uh, it's, it's, it's just, it's, it's like, it's like, it's just like how I feel more. So I built this big world and there's just no one in it. This is basically like my life and you know, for like you know, four or five years I guess. Just just devoid and it's empty and a ghost town. Weird I guess. But you know, it's pushing onward, maybe things all of a sudden change. I don't know. It's instead of saying I don't know, I'm being weird. But um I don't know, I thought to think about it, I guess. It's a type of crazy, crazy, crazy game going on here. And um yeah, that's about it. I'm just nearing the end of all the stuff I've done. It's just mostly you know, just all the most of the same, you know. It's mostly just you know, playing. I was actually just finished some of these rooms today. I was like, oh my god, it's almost a week now. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta push these uh, get this video out. You know, it's like gotta, it's gotta like, get this, this, this. No, it's not, it's not rush it right now. But like, you know, actually, come on, get my ass in gear. You know, I gotta make some, I gotta get that god, meet that thing. You know, that that release date. You know, it's, it's not very articulate how I'm saying that, but if and it's just a really ay 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 anyway. This is with the amnesia and Matthew and what have you, uh starting out this is all the way done mostly and uh so yeah, goodbye, take care, have fun and uh see you next time I suppose. Or next week or whatever. Bye for now.